Assalamu alaikum, hello, hi and welcome to Cooking is Fun with Firdaus. Today we are going to see how to make prawn butter masala. This is one of the delicious recipes ever I have tried it and uh, I'm sure you're going to love this. For this recipe we need nice jumbo prawns, about 200 grams cleaned and I'm going to first squeeze half lemon into it along with uh, ginger garlic paste, red chilli powder, turmeric powder, coriander powder, garam masala and salt per taste also food color once this is added I'm going to marinate this well and let this sit for about 10 to 15 minutes meanwhile I'm going to make a fine paste of large tomatoes and cashews moving on after 10-15 minutes I'm going to add around 2 teaspoons of oil and butter to a pan and then I'm going to place my prawns to fry them until they are slightly crispy on both the sides. This should be done on a medium flame. And once this is done, I'm going to take the prawns out. And in a very low flame, I'll add the whole garam masalas along with some chopped onions in a low flame. Ensure it doesn't burn the masala and cook until it's slightly translucent. After that, I'll add 1 teaspoon of ginger garlic paste I mean some tomato chopped and a few green chilies with pudina and coriander. I'll mix this gently and let this cook for about a minute and so. Once the tomatoes are translucent and cooked well, I will add the tomato and cashew paste to it along with some water and ensure that this cooks well for another 5 minutes in a medium flame. After 5 minutes, I'll check it's looking completely cooked I'll now add on the prawns to it and again give it a gentle mix and cook for another five minutes after five minutes I feel it's completely ready now but still I'm going to add another half teaspoon of butter and half cup of cooking cream to it and mix all these ingredients well together and cook for another five minutes in a medium flame I can see the butter has started to ooze out from its sides which means the curry is ready now to be served. So I serve it with hot puris or parathas. You can serve with any of your choice. I hope you love this recipe, enjoyed, do try it and please share your comments below. Thank you and stay tuned with Cooking is Fun with Firdaus. Allah Hafiz.